At first, a bunion on Sally Tipton's right foot was a nuisance. Then it started to hurt. Simple things were becoming painful, simple activities, so I knew it was time. A bunion forms when the first metatarsal shifts away from the other toes. At the same time, the big toe slips to the inside. The real challenge is to get the angular deformity back over in a corrected position. When Sally reached the end of her rope, she opted for a fix co-developed by Dr. Holmes. Why should we break the bone to change the angular deformity if there's a potential of changing it without breaking the bone? And, and that was the genesis for creating the mini tightrope. For the mini tightrope procedure, small holes are drilled in the first and second toe bones, and a cable is secured on either side. We link a, a fiber wire suture, which is almost like a wire, but it's flexible. We then just, it's like winching up the tower piece and making it straight again. After realigning the bones, ligaments are tightened to hold everything in place. After about six weeks, patients are back in regular shoes. And if a bunion returns, you still have options. So you haven't burned any bridges. Um, so you still have all the other techniques that you still have available, even using the tightrope again. Sally's glad she decided to walk on this tightrope. My foot doesn't hurt. Other parts of my body hurt. Not my foot. <laughs> Keeping her on sure footing for years to come. This is Janet Vassell reporting.